I'm Richard McSorley and I am enrolled in the Aviation Maintenance Technician Program. It's sort of an inside joke. We call our license the Willy Wonka Golden Ticket. Once you earn it, everybody around our community knows exactly what its value is. If you walk in with that, it proves that you've dedicated over 2,000 hours to training and you can take that with you everywhere you go. In the next five to ten years, it's projected out that the baby boomers will be retiring out, creating a huge vacuum and need for this field. Companies actually do push their employees to earn this degree because you go from a non-skilled employee to a skilled employee, which can command a greater salary. I chose the community college because, one, the, the cost to benefit. No matter where you go, you have the same earning potential. So if you can invest a little less money and a little more time, in my opinion, that seems like the better route to go. Some of the drawbacks with earning an airframe and power plant license are the commitment of hours. In some programs, it can take up to two years. Some soft skills that somebody would need to have is self-motivation, positive attitude, working in team environments, and then some hard skills would be basic arithmetic, the ability to work well with their hands. What I would tell other people who wanted to get into the aviation maintenance program is take your assessment exams, find out where your weaknesses are, and start working on them. Show up on time, show dedication, show passion for the, the industry, and sell yourself. If you believe in this, then you can achieve it.